Shalom Israel, back with another lesson, want to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Raka Kwadash, double honors to the apostles and elders who teach and rule well at Great Millstone, and peace and salutations and peace and mercy to the hopeful elect, the 144,000 of prophets, and to the men and women of the 12 lost tribes of Israel, you so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native American Indians. Shalom. Back with another lesson. Not sure what I'll title this. Um, but we're going to go in on the two-thirds. You know, there, the 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 disrespect, the um, you know, no no humbleness, the ungratefulness, it it it, just, it still continues all the way dating back to when, um. You know, when Israel, when we first came out of the first Egypt. I'm going to get a couple uh, scripts and get to, I won't make this too long, but, you know, Jake is, they're, they're just, they're extremely disrespectful. Jake two-thirds of Jake is going to pay a heavy, heavy price for what they for what they've done. They continue to mock the word. You know, they want to follow what Esau say. They give all respect to Esau. Esau tell them to do something, they do it. They do it. They believe in the money. They claim that they believe in the Lord, but they they chasing that they they they're chasing that money. The women are just they're just gone. Two third of you Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. Two third of you Israelite women. You're you you are finished. You don't like order. You don't want to get in order. You had your own uh, morals and standards. The men, you know... They, they cater to the woman and, you know, want to, you know, put her on a pedal stool. And, then, you know, I can understand you had your wife, you know, you're, you know, there's a certain, you know, the way you're, you're doing it according to your how by Shemel was shy. But to just full fledged lay down and just let them do and run wild. You're, you're completely out of order. And that's what, that's a, a lot of you, you know, you two-third Jakes is doing. Then you got the other side of the two-thirds, two of you Jakes that's trying to, you know, trying to be a player and trying to pimp and, you know, do all that. That's not doing thus said the Lord. That's not doing to the to to the God of the Holy Bible, Yahweh by Shem Shai, the God, the power of uh, Israel, the Hebrew Israelites. And Jake has a has a tough problem. They have a they Jake has a it's like they're it's like they're paralyzed. They can't stop smoking weed. Jake can't stop smoking weed. And according to Jake, you tell Jake, you know, what the Lord is, 
you know, what the Lord said, and, and they claim, you know, the, the, the Lord, you, you can smoke, he put it here for a reason. He put that plant here for a reason. You can smoke weed. Really? Is that what the Lord said to do? Is Was the Lord going around and rolling up, you know, weed and smoking it and passing it around? Is that what he was doing? Show me. Prove it. Jake want to party all night long. All they want to do is party. They believe in some of the most craziest far out stuff ever. Jake is just completely gone. And the women want to be, the women want to be whores. Two thirds of you Jake women, you Negroes, Latinos and Native American Indian women, you want to be whores, man. You dress provocative. You walk around with gold all in your mouth, smoking and drinking all tattooed up, just through, gone. And the Lord's going to punish you for that. The time is coming. Time is coming. We're going to go to Deuteronomy 31 and 29. And these are the words of Moses. These are this, this is like the the because Moses Moses didn't he didn't get to see the uh the promised land. He brought Israel out of Egypt. He did thus said the Lord. He went off, but he didn't get to see the promised land. But he's gonna rule. He's gonna have rulership in, in that kingdom. Next and under Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai. Next to and under Yahweh by Shemiawashai. Yahweh by Shemiawashai will rule overall in the kingdom. He's number one, umero numero, number one. Then it's going to go down the line as far as rulership. But this is what he's telling Israel coming out of uh, uh, the first Egypt. Deuteronomy 31, 29. We'll go Deuteronomy 31 and 28. Salakia. We'll start there. Deuteronomy 31 and 28. And it reads, Gather unto me all the elders of your tribes, the twelve tribes, of Israel. Moses said, gather unto me all the elders of your tribes and your officers that I may, that I may speak these words in their ears and call heaven and earth to record against them. Moses is about to tell them, about to tell them the flat out truth. 29. What it, let's hear what Moses had to say. For I know that after my death, ye will utterly corrupt yourselves. And that's exactly what's going on. Jake has completely corrupted their self. The two thirds of Jake, they so they show no signs of coming back to Yahweh by Shem Shai and serving this Bible. I even got family members telling me, you know, don't don't do, you know try to speak the word to them. Don't bring that stuff around me. I don't want to hear it. Don't bring that. Get away from me with that stuff. Are you really? Are you serious? I anointed, you know, my little nephew and my my brother's son, you know, and my brother, he's a, he's a hard head. 
you know, and his, his son, my little nephew, I anointed him. He going to wipe the anointing, the, the, you know, the, uh, 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 the anointment off his head. Talking about, you know, uh, my mom, he, you know, he lived with his mom. Talking about my mom, uh, 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 she doesn't do that. We don't do that at, at my house. We, we ain't at your house. We're at, we're uncle, we're at uncle's house. But this is where this is where it is. This is where it is, Israel. This is where we are in 2022. He talking about, you know, uh I we watch TikTok. For I know that after my death ye will utterly corrupt yourselves. And that's what it is. Israel's corrupt. They don't want to hear the word of Yahweh by Shemel. They can care less about this. But they'll tell you, you know, I believe in Jesus. I believe in Jesus. They, 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 they don't care nothing. They're gang banging. They're prostituting, you know, uh, stealing and uh, 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 killing and doing drugs, trying to be the hardest drug dealer on the block all day. They can care less about Yahweh by Shemel Shai. Stealing and committing adultery. You know, all type of stuff. They're, they're just gone. Gone. And turn aside from, from the way which I have commanded you. And evil will befall you in the latter days. And that's what's going on right now in the latter days. In these days. This is the latter days. 2022. This is over 5,000 years ago. Moses is talking about this. Let me read it again. Deuteronomy 31, 29. For I know that after my death, ye will utterly corrupt yourself and turn aside from the way which I have commanded you. And evil will befall you in the latter days. Because ye will do evil in the sight of Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai to provoke him to anger through the work of your hands. And so this is what's going to happen. Let's go to Revelation 21 and 8. This is this is what's coming. This is what's coming, Israel. Two thirds of you, Israel. Cause y'all ain't gonna get it. You ain't gonna get it. Revelation twenty-one We'll start at twenty we'll go Revelation twenty one and eight. We'll start at eight. But the fearful and unbelieving, and that's what and that and that's what it is. The fearful and unbelieving, and the abominable, and murderers, and whoremongers, and sorcerers, and idolaters, and all liars shall have their part. In the lake which burneth with fire and brimstone, which is the second death. Call Halal Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai. You're gonna burn. All you liars and, and, and uh, adulterers and idolatry, idolaters, you know, bucking up and mocking against the uh, 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 um, against the apostles and elders starting. Uh, 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 with the apostles and elders at Great Millstone and the prophets on down, mocking them continually daily, you know, sighing with the enemy, kissing Esau's butt, you know, uh, celebrating Christmas, celebrating Thanksgiving, all these false holidays, and you don't want to uh, uh, celebrate any of the holy days, you're done. You are finished. You, you don't want to do thus said the Lord. You gon' you're gonna burn in this lake of fire when these ICBM missiles hit this 
a, a city near you. That's what's coming. You're going to melt. You're going to melt. You adulterers, idolatry. You're, you're, you're in the Kemet. You're in the uh, Mormonism, Mormon. You're in the uh, uh, Egyptology. You're in the, you are in the all, but you don't believe the words of this book. You don't believe these prophecies and you don't want to listen to the word that the apostles and the elders starting uh, 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 at Great Millstone on down. Don't want to, you don't want to hear what they have to say. You don't want to hear what the prophets have to say. Ultimately, the word of Yahweh by Shemiah Shai, the power, the God of the Hebrew Israelites, the power, the power and God of you so-called Negroes, Latinos and Native American Indians. You're in the struggle. You're in captivity. You have to go to work every single day and slay, taking the lowest jobs, scrubbing floors for two bucks an hour. Why Esau sit in his office and spin around in his chair, you know, making a uh, uh, five hundred thousand a year or two million a year, whatever it is, something up there, and telling you what to do. You working nine, ten, eleven hours can't enjoy your kids. Call law you how by Shemel and Shai. You, 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 Jakes, you two third Jakes are going to burn. All you carnally minded Jakes, you think that the, a, a gun can save you. A gun's not going to save you. When Esau bring this military and this technology and devices in to shut you down, you know, you won't be able to do your gun ain't going to save you. Call her law, Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai. You two third Jakes, you're finished. Finished. With that, I just want to go in um, on my spirit. Been seeing a lot of. Uh, you know, Jake's two third Jake's, they just they're far gone, man. They're far gone. So, you know, on top of that, you know, you got the kids, they don't wanna they don't wanna they don't honor their parents at all. It says honor thy mother and thy father. If I'm if I'm correct, if I'm quoting right in uh Exodus. Honor your mother and father. Honor, honor. Look up that word honor. High respect, high regard, admiration. Honor your mother and father. Get them a chair before you get me a chair. You open the door before you open uh, uh, the door for me. You open the door for them before you open it for me. Get them a plate. Bring them a plate as they get older. Cook them some food, clean a house, buy them something, you know, honor. Two third of Jake children, they don't want to do that. They're telling their parents what to do at nine, 10 years old. That's because the parents is gone. The parents is gone. So. But on my, it was on my spirit. Lord willing, I come back with another lesson. Lord willing, uh, you were edified. I want to give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Rakakwadash. Shalom, Israel.